Well, hi, boys and girls. How's it going? Well, I was just uh, wandering down here at church, and I found this really awesome armor. <coughs> it's really cool. I wonder what it's called. And I wonder if, I, if it has anything to deal with cheese or eating more cheese, or maybe I could keep cheese in it. Maybe it'll act like a giant refrigerator for me to keep more cheese on my long road trips when I go and visit my mom. What do you think, guys? Oh, oh. hi, Miss Kate. How's it going? Hey, Louie. Hey, I see you found our breastplate of righteousness. Oh, is that what it's called? Yes. I thought it was called the chest plate of Colbert. No. Oh, no, Louie, you're so silly. No, it's our breastplate of righteousness. Do you know what part piece of armor this is? This is the piece of armor, the breastplate of righteousness, but what is it protecting? Do you know? Um, my stomach. Well, yeah, it is kind of protecting your stomach, but there's something even more important. Important. Oh, my small intestine. No, Louis. pancreas. No, something. Liver. That beats. Ba -bum, uh, ba -bum, ba -bum. Oh, I know. The music in my heart. Oh, yeah. Well, Louis, Louis, Louis. Yes. Oof, you got part of it right. Your heart is exactly right. Oh, just my the heart. The breastplate got of it. righteousness protects your heart. Ah. Yeah. Do you, so do you think it's like a real piece of armor that we put on? I don't know. Let me throw myself against the side of this table, okay? Here we go. Ready? No, Louie, 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 Louie. It did. It worked, Miss Kate. Okay, that was yeah. amazing. Oh, boy. Kids, girls, don't try home. this at home. Oh, no, We're yes. professional. Yeah, please don't try that at home. Louie, don't do that. You might get hurt. This is just a toy armor. It's oh. not a real piece of armor. And the armor, the heart we're key, wanting to protect today is your spiritual heart. Oh. I mean, the breastplate of righteousness is all about protecting your heart by using things like the word of God and oh. prayer and getting right with God. Got it. That yeah. makes a lot more sense. Yeah, but you do look pretty snazzy in thank that you, armor, Louie. I really Side do profile, like boom. it. Side profile, boom. Oh, boy. Oh. <laughs> well, we're going to move on to our object lesson, Louie, but you better run and show some people how cool you look in that snazzy armor. Maybe tell them about the breastplate of righteousness, okay? Okay, that sounds good, Miss Kate. All right, go for it, Louie. Thanks. Okay, boys and girls, so like I was telling Louie, we are learning about the breastplate of righteousness and how to get our hearts right with God. And how do we do that? Well, I've got a little object lesson for you today to kind of explain it. So, we've got two hearts here, two bottles. Everything kind of looks the same, very similar, but there's something very different about these hearts, and I wonder if you can see why. When I take my little stick, and poke it in this one, it, it, it just comes right out. I wonder, do you think that I would be able to lift this bottle just using this stick? No. Come on, let's try again. Nope. I can't lift that bottle. Maybe we should try this heart. Hmm, let's see. You think I will be able to lift this bottle just by pulling up on the stick? Whoa. I can do it. I did it again. Oh my goodness. Now, I have to be honest with you. Both these bottles are the same. They both have rice in them. They both have hearts on them. They're both very similar. The only difference is how I prepared these bottles. You see, when I made this bottle, I filled it with rice. And it's got some rice in there. But when I made this bottle, I packed it with rice. I squished so many things in that heart so it was so tight that when I lift it up, it could hang on. And that's the same thing we have to do to our hearts. We have to put so much good stuff so that we can be right with God, like prayer and reading his word. And we need to pack it all in there. When we read our Bible every day, when we pray, when we talk to God, when we show his love to others, all of that is putting more seeds of rice into our hearts and pushing them down so that we are protected and we are strong and able to lift up off the ground. That's the only difference between these bottles. 
It's trusting in God and getting your heart right with him. You will be able to do incredible things. So I think it's time to go check on our friends with the toughness challenge. Come on guys, let's go. Well, hey guys, you ready for that toughness challenge? Uh, what? Oh, oh, oh boy. What is going on with you guys? You guys don't look really tough. You don't look like you're ready for a toughness challenge. Guys, we, what happened? We made a... Oh. 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 oh, guys. Bad decision. A bad decision? What was the decision? What were you doing? So many bad decisions. How many? How many? Had, had, to, be, had to be 35. 35? 35 what? See, I thought it was closer to 40. Whoa. Whoa, that is a That's big pretty tough. bottle of water. Mm. What it's is not going cutting on? It. It's not cutting it. What's wrong with Am you guys? I, why just let me? You're looking kind of hot. Hot. Hot? Hot from what? Hot it, it, wings. Be, hot wings? It had to be 50. 50 hot wings? Each. It might have been Each. 60. It could have been. I lost track around between the habanero, the cayenne. Oh no. What was the one? What was the one that made me throw up? The Carolina Reaper. The Carolina Reaper. It's the worst. Okay. Oh, but I think they should rename it the Satan. The yeah. What I don't understand oh. is why did you guys oh. eat so many hot wings? Everyone. Do you have heartburn? Where's where's is the Is that heart? what this is? Where's my heart? Oh, well, yeah. Here? Yeah, does Here? it burn? There is no Here? heart. Does it burn? It's just fire. Everything burns? Yeah. But why? Why I, do you guys do that? I would say it felt like lava if lava was on fire. It's like we were playing a game, the floor is lava, but now our esophagus is lava. We ate the floor. Because it was lava. Because it was lava. Oh boy. Oh I boy. I don't feel so tough, Kathy. Yeah, well, I you guys don't look so tough. Maybe you guys aren't up for the toughness challenge this week. I mean, this kind of oh. goes with what we're talking about. They didn't do a very good job at taking care of their physical heart, and we've been talking about taking care of our you, spiritual you heart. I think hot coffee would help, but it doesn't. No, I don't think so. They oh. they've got to rest oh, oh, oh. up. Feel my Maybe. head. Feel my head. Ha! I should have worn. Did you see that? There I was did. Steam. I did. Maybe we should come check in with them next week for the toughness challenge. They gotta rest up and cool down. Before we leave, we had to make sure we got Fred his breastplate of righteousness so he would be guarded. And our song, you remember it? Be strong in the Lord and his mighty ways. Put on the armor of God, wear it every day so you can take a stand against the devil's schemes. Let's name the armor of God and what they mean. Put on the armor of God. Now we've got a new verse for you today. Truth and righteousness, they will guide our way. So next week, you guys practice that new verse and we'll put it all together. Bye.